the system tracked time using a floating point number. But after several hours of operation, the tiny rounding error accumulated into a 0.34 second delay. That doesn't sound like much, right? But at Mach 5, or about 1,700 meters per second, that delay meant the missile was off by 578 meters. That's almost two football fields. This is a real world example of limits. Suppose the error in the system's tracking followed this function E of t. What we're interested in is what happens to the error in the long term. So let's take the limit as t approaches infinity and see what happens. Using the squeeze theorem, we can show that the limit of the quantity E raised to the negative 0.05 t times sine of 0.1 t equals 0. So the limit of E of t equals 0 minus 0.34, which is negative 0.34. Now what this means is that over time, the error never disappears, and the system can never fully correct itself.